In today's Fat Girl video, we're going to discuss kennel cough pneumonia. This is more commonly known in the literature as community-acquired infectious pneumonia of puppies. Now, if you're presented a dog, typically an English bulldog, that was recently purchased from a pet store that may have dyspnea, tachypnea, mucopurulent discharge, one of our top differentials is Bordetella bronchoseptica that's developed into a progressive severe pneumonia. On radiographs, we can see alveolar disease, and treatment needs to be aggressive as this can result in mortality without appropriate antibiotic treatment and supportive care. Treatment's going to include hydration, nebulization and cupage, appropriate antibiotic therapy, which often includes some type of gram-negative coverage, and nutritional support. Here in this video, you can demonstrate how not to cupage a dog. This is gently petting a dog versus using more aggressive cupage with both hands cupped on both sides of the thorax. Based on a study by Radhak Rishnan, published out of University of Pennsylvania back in 2007, the survival for puppies with kennel cough pneumonia was good, with over 88% of dogs surviving. However, the mean hospitalization was typically one week, 7.2 days. Again, with aggressive supportive care, most of these puppies do well. However, keep in mind that Bordetella pneumonia can be very, very severe in puppies and requires aggressive supportive care.